This question is about the relationship between pressure, volume, and temperature of an amount of gas. It's important and needs some concentration. A vertical cylinder has a smooth, well fitted piston in it. Weights can be added to or removed from a tray on the top of the piston. A. Weights are added to the tray as shown in figure. State what happens to the pressure of the air in the cylinder as a result of adding these weights. Of course, if we add weights to the tray, the piston will go down and the volume will decrease. When the volume decreases, this means the pressure will increase. Question B. The weights are kept as shown in figure. The temperature of the air in the cylinder is increased. State what happens to the volume of the air in the cylinder as a result of this temperature rise. Double I. State how, if at all, the pressure of the air changes as the temperature changes. Both questions I and double I are related to each other, and the answer of double I depends on how you will answer I. Now the question says that the temperature is increased. Of course, if you increase the temperature, the air will expand. This means that the volume will increase by increasing the temperature. Now let's go to double I. State how, if at all, the pressure of the air changes as the temperature changes. Now remember here, the temperature increased. So, when he asks about what happens to the pressure, normally you will think that the pressure will increase because they are directly proportional to each other. If temperature increases, the pressure will increase. But wait a minute, this only will happen. If volume is unchanged, the direct proportionality between the temperature and pressure is in condition that the volume is unchanged and did not increase or decrease. So, the pressure will not increase. Because in I, you already said that your volume has increased. So, the answer will be pressure will stay the same. If temperature and volume Increase with each other. Pressure will not increase. It will stay the same. See the next question for more understanding. Triple I. State what must be done to prevent the volume change in BI. Question 4. The volume change in BI is prevented. State what happens to the pressure of the air in the cylinder. Okay, let's see now. Now the temperature is increased and he wants to prevent the volume from changing. To do this, he simply can add more loads on the tray. This is to keep the volume constant. So we can say add more loads. Question 4. Now we prevented any change in the volume. State what happened to the pressure of the air in the cylinder. The temperature increased. But the volume is unchanged. In this case, and only in this case, we can say that the pressure will increase. Because now the volume is constant. We can summarize this as follows. Any gas can be represented by three things. Pressure, volume, and temperature. If two factors change with each other, the third one must be constant. So, if you study the change in pressure with temperature, which is directly proportional, so as temperature increases, pressure will increase, the volume must be constant. If you study the change in volume with temperature, so as temperature increases, volume will increase. In this case, the pressure will be constant. Please repeat this video until you completely understand the idea of the question.